Are you new to Amazon KDP and you are facing issues with setting up your book interior templates including ebooks or paperback books then you are at the right place. Because in this video I will show you step by step process how to correctly format your ebook and paperback books inside Microsoft Word. I have a blank document and here you can see I am on the layout. First of all I will talk about the ebooks. You can go to file and click new and then click blank document. Here you will be on this page. Then you need to go to layout and for ebook you need to change the size to letter that would be totally fine for an ebook you can even set it to custom size like you can go to more paper sizes and if you want to set up ebook of 6 into 9 that's totally fine too but in most of the cases stick with the letter size page that is 8.5 into 11 so let's go back to pre-made template inside microsoft word all you need to do is go to margins go to custom margins here and here you need to set up the top margin and the bottom margin left and the right before doing this just go to multiple pages here and change this to mirror margins like this and now you can set up your margins if you want to change to it to 0.5 you can do that if you want to add bigger margins you can do that too that would be your inside margin that is here inside that would be the your left hand side page and that would be your right hand side page the inside margin is here that is top that is bottom that is the outside margin and that is the inside so inside margins are bigger than the outside margin so you can set it as one and that would be your outside margin as 0.5 this is totally fine for an ebook if you want to set a bit bigger margin you can go with that too and toward the bottom you can leave as 0.5 toward the outside you can also leave at 0.5 and toward the inside you can leave as one inch leave this gutter at zero click the apply this template to whole document and click ok and you would be good to go with your ebook now let's talk about the paperback books for that i have opened this document from amazon kdp that is set trim size bleed and margins before setting up your interior templates in, inside microsoft word you need to have a few things in mind first of all you need to have a knowledge of bleed if you have images that are extended toward the edges of the page like this one then you need to go with bleed if you don't have images like this and your content is like this images are well within the margins in that case you would be using no bleed let's suppose you have no bleed we will create this template you need to scroll down and see the kdb interior examples with and without bleed this is the page size without bleed these are the templates offered by amazon kdb these are the page sizes with bleed so we are going with out bleed so in that case we can simply in insert our page size like 6 into 9 or you can also go with 7 into 10 7.5 into 9.25 7.44 into 9.69 this would be your exact page size and your images should not go beyond margins you have bigger sizes like 8.25 into 8.25 let's first set up this one 6 into 9 just go to layout go to size more paper sizes just enter 6 here and 9 here then go to margins and adjust the margins for paperback kdp requires minimum margins let's see the minimum margins for paperback books so if your page count is within 150 pages like 24 is minimum and the maximum is 150 that would be one range and 151 to 300 is the second range and so on so most of the books fall under this in that case your interior margin or gutter should be at least 0.375 let's suppose you have this one you are using without bleed that is no bleed and for without bleed all other margins should be at least 0.25 inches let's create this one go back to here that would be our top margin 0.25 these are our outside margins 0.25 inside margin should be at least 0.375 and here you can also set 0.25 that is what kdp recommends at minimum to be on safer side you can always set this a bit bigger like 0.5 and you can also increase this as well like 0.5 here 0.5 here so that your books get approved without any issues increase this slightly if you want so like you can set this as 0.75 that is recommended minimum margins was 0.25 but i am setting as 0.5 0.5 here 0.5 here and the 
inside margin is slightly larger than the other margin click ok that would be your paper bag book 6 into 9 without bleed next we are going to set the same interior template but this time we are setting up the with bleed first of all you need to go to interior size like we are setting this one and this time we are using with bleed our interior template size would be slightly larger to do that we will go back to size and paper that is 0.125 and here is height is slightly larger 9.25 we have set up our interior template first now we will go back to the margins again custom margins and here they recommend for a paper back book with bleed minimum margin should be if the page count is 24 to 150 at max at least 0 0.375 all margin should be this one My gutter should be at least this one or other margin should be like this in no bleed case the outer margin was 0 0.25 in case of with bleed the outer margin should be at least 0 0.375 they say you need to set at least 375 375 here and 0.375 0 point or no point 375 here and they are also recommending you need to set 0 0.375 here these are their minimum margins but we want to be more safer we want to increase inside margin to at least 0.5 i am setting this to at least 0.75 here i am setting this to 0.5 again here 0.5 and here 0.5 now you have interior template with bleed in that case if you import any image here either you need to extend toward the edges or keep it in within the margins let me show you let's first draw any shape here insert shape and let's suppose these are our margins change the margin our interior template was 9.25 and we added margin of 0.5 minus 0.5 top and minus 0.5 toward the bottom remaining would be 8.25 height would be 8.25 i'm visually showing you the margins 8.25 now when it comes to width let's calculate again 6.125 minus inside margin that is 0.75 and deduct the outside margin that would be 0.5 now you are left with 4.875 now you can click here go to alignment align center and then align middle this would be your safer area let's remove the fill here no fill outline should be our like a dotted one this is your margins this is inside margin that is outside margin i want to show you how to add images in that case let me pause the video and i will upload an image here i imported this simple image to demonstrate how to place images while using with bleed interiors on amazon kdp with bleed either you need to select image like like this so that it is well inside the margins or you need to increase the size like this it is totally going toward the edges don't leave any white space here otherwise your book will be rejected don't leave any white space here or here on the right or left side enlarge like this i hope you got the idea how to set up your an ebook or paperback interior templates inside work if you have questions do let me know in the comment section i would be happy to answer that if you are new to my channel do subscribe if you want me to create more videos like this do let me know thanks for watching see you in the next video